Attack on Titan, Chapter 109, Guide. We're with Falco and Gabby, and they're at that farm. A bunch of border collies and horses. Wait here. Okay. Those horses will be useful in our escape. What are you talking about? I might have killed the prison guard. We gotta run to some place further. They will soon come here as well to investigate. Will they? Uh... We're gonna get caught if we run away without any thoughts. Let's ask them if we could stay here for a few days. If there is a farm, then we should be able to work here. I can't have meals with devils. She's just waiting. Hey, it's like, it's like kachink. She comes out. Come in. I'll explain everything. So don't say anything stupid. And they go in. Wait. What did you kids run away for? That's Sasha's family. Southern Marley dialect. Nice to meet you. We are Ben and Maya, and we are siblings. We have had some trouble, so we decided to run away from our parents. If there are things we can do, then we will do anything to help. So please, let's stay here for a few days. I beg you. And they bow down. Sure thing. Kids aren't supposed to bow. Welcome to Bronze family. Feel free to stay here as long as you want. That's her father. Oh, now let's have some breakfast first. Duh. Thank you very much. So they're sitting down. Give me a meal. Uh, you tired, aren't you? After you eat, lie down and get some rest, will you? She's like puts her head on her hand on her head. And she's like smacks away. Eek. Like I was like scrambling like oh. She's like going oh. She's like wide eyed. Uh, Lisa, this girl. She's like stop it. I'm sorry. It seems that you have experienced something terrible. It's like, no, like, sorry about my little sister. Let's dig in then. Like, Fab goes like, it's delicious, it's delicious. And everyone's like, looking at Gabby. So she's like, eating, yum. And the, gr the girl's like, bling eyed. So we're going to, um, it's, uh, Azamabito. Congratulations on the Mali operation. Uh, the leader of the Haz Hazuru nation commended Eldia, Eldia's bravery as well. I appreciate the compliment. However, we wouldn't have achieved this victory without your faith in us, Miss Az Azubabito. Azumabito. Mm. You visited us. Despite the whole world seeing our country as a danger, that's what should be com complimented. Okay. I'm sorry that this turned out to be a small farewell. Despite my wishes. No. The fact that you came here is more than enough. Or she's leaving? Also, I understand that the voluntary soldier wasn't the first opponent. Thank you for your understanding. Please come again. To the most dangerous island in the world. Yes. Since our objective this time is to see that danger ourselves. So, is that an observer in, uh, of this case? Huh? Yes, that will be the first airship which uses ice per stone as fuel in the in the world. If a aircraft, we'll make sure to see the power of rumbling. We got a bunch of people in from the gate. Hey, Hanji, explain what's happening. Also, civilians are to be moved out in Shingashina district. They're going back. Out in, moved out in. That's weirdly worded. Are they supposed to go out of Shingashin District or go in? Okay. It was the military who supported the Reeves meeting regarding the reconstruction in that district. There is a rumor that the voluntary soldier has been arrested. Is this true? There is also information that says Aaron Yeager, who, who has led Eldia to victory, has been confined. <laughs> uh, yeah. You're not supposed to ask me this. Well, Hanji's like, just deflecting. This isn't a, uh, isn't this a bit too much? Like, ask the soldier. What are you going to reply? Wait, what are you going to reply to the comment that the outside world's attention is being focused on the military of paradise? I said, ask the soldier. Get out of the way. It's like, he's in front of her, the newspaper guy. Hanji. Four years ago, you guys revealed the truth about the world to the people inside the walls. The truth that our enemy is the entire world. And then we are all titans. Well, now there are people that can turn into titans. 
However, the victory Aaron brought gave us a future, a future where Eldians can live. That means the relationship between Aaron and the military is a concern for all the citizens. Anji, you said that truth should be known to all. Have you changed your stance? The situation has changed. Because the walls have opened and we have connected with the rest of the world, the mean information has changed. Understand it's a difficult situation, Anji. So I want you to look me in the eye and tell me that I can trust you. Like Luke Peck? It's all for the sake of the people of Eldia. So I goes in. Close the door. Ah. Everyone gather around. Are you the ones who leaked information about Aaron? Uh, Audra? Bean? Or Beam? Uh, Luis? You knew recruits and... Flouch. So it's down. Why did you do this? To free Aaron. He did nothing wrong. He did what he had to do. He faced an incredibly powerful enemy. And came out victorious. Uh, he did that on his own volition. This victory is an overwhelming power of the rumbling. And it's our right of existence. Aaron saved the lives of every citizen of the new Elden Empire. It's Eldia, to be precise. But this victory also gave the military forces of the world even more reasons to launch an all-out attack on this tiny island of Earth. Of Earth. Uh, don't you think that it seriously endangered our right to exist instead? If we didn't have the rumbling, I suppose it did. Either way, if we didn't have any power, we wouldn't be able to live on. Not on this tiny island. There's no guarantee that the rumbling would work as we expect and save us at all. To be honest, it's nothing about it's nothing but hearsay. That's because you've been keeping Aaron locked up behind bars, isn't it? Room's quiet. Can we afford to waste time like this? Six continues. A recent great victory will become meaningless. The one who leads this nation is Aaron Yeager. I ask that you free him immediately. Are they? Yeah, you could be right. Nevertheless, I was the one who decided to go through with Zeke's plan. It's all my responsibility. That's why I can't forgive anyone who continues to act on their own. It's like looking at him. Can't forgive Aaron? You guys will be punished for leaking information about Aaron. Take these four to their cells. Okay. I will hope and pray for the victory of humanity within the walls. Hmm. The stage always needs someone in this role. When one actor leaves, another jumps in to take his place. Good luck, Hanji. Just crying. They raise their hands, just shaking. How tiring. Oh, someone want to be a leader. Which makes it the best choice to be a leader. No. There's something I still need to look into. Okay, we got Aaron? No. Have you been in this cell as well? Huh? No. Is that so? That's a pity. But still, I don't regret breaching military conduct. The Mikasa? Yeah, this Mikasa. If victory is if, if victory is the Survey Corps' ultimate goal, sometimes rules have to be broken to achieve it. That's enough, Luis. Your sentence will your sentence will only be extended. Ever since you saved my life that day, I have not changed. After seeing you defeat the Titan with human strength, I realized. Oh, back when they were trying to get... Oh, she was a little girl? Did we... Back when uh, Reese was trying to go through the small, narrow uh, way. They can't, that you can't protect anything without strength. I learned that. When faced with senseless violence, we can fight. You were saved too, right? By Mr. Jaeger? Like, dealing with her... <laughs> scarf. Think about Aaron. Since that day, I've wanted to be near you. I. Huh? What's the reason you joined the Survey Corps? If it was for Mr. Yeager, his freedom, there's only one thing I can say. Be quiet. Okay, she's walking away. Hmm. Remember stabbing the, the guy who's trying... Oh. Aaron stabbed the dude who was trying to take her away. Is it right now? It's up with the knife. Don't worry. 
Okay. How is your room? Uh, it offers an impressive view of the landscape. If these are balls, we're not here. Okay, we got the people who came over there. I've already said this a few times, but we Eldians are, for, are forever in the debt to you volunteers for what you've done. Like, has a bunch of papers. You especially seem to have a great deal of trust in our relationship. We, st we steadily submitted behavior re records to us. Okay. But the thought occurred to me. Seems like you were, you were desperate not to come off as someone suspicious. So, wait. You put yourself under strict control and asked for soldiers to inspect you. Even today, ten months ago, during the railway opening ceremony in Trost. The person in charge of inspecting you suddenly changed. The Flotch Florster. During, this, during the ceremony, he took you to, near, to a nearby property. He's currently under arrest for leaking information. They're working together? That building was only a few kilometers away from Aaron Yeager's residence at that time. I believe it's possible that you made contact with Aaron. Wait, what? Seems like Aaron started acting on his own afterwards. Either way. I'm glad to have an excuse to converse with a beautiful lady like you. I could talk all I could talk all day long. Okay. Three gabbing Falco. Clean up the horse stables. It's like horse like chomping her. Ah Gabby. It's like, why is he using her real name? It's like uh gah, Gabby. It's like boom, like over Gabby. why did this happen? This was an act of the devils. Wasn't it just a horse? It's like this horse isn't going to give you a, a ride and run away from you. Didn't, re, didn't it retrieve equestrian training? We can't get information if we're going to stay here. I think it's better to stay here than move around. What are you saying? Let's stay low and wait here until we're rescued. This nation's military committed such atrocity against Marley. Soon, the rule will send their troops to attack this nation. My brother or Zeke will definitely come to save us. Uh, no, Zeke. I don't, I don't think Zeke's gonna. Do we need Zeke? That traitor's somewhere close by, is he? There's nothing we can do now. I can't tell her that I was the one who delivered Aaron Yeager's letter yet. That's right. <laughs> Just get... That's uh, that's one of the theories. Was like, uh, is is Aaron giving letters to Zeke? Like, though it wouldn't matter anymore either way. Well, she's going to be mad at you anyways. Anyways, what was that about, Maya? Uh, am I your little sister or something? Doesn't matter, does it? You two, time for lunch. Yes, let's take a break. You two learned so quickly how to work. Uh, you are strong too. <laughs> no, but thanks. It's like Gabby's like whopping her while well, drying her hair. However, Kaya... Uh, you are strong too. The people working here seem all very young. Yes, the people here are, are orphans. Ah, so that's it. They're orphans. Uh, by the queen's policy, the children who have who have nowhere to go receive much support. Children who lost their parents four years ago gather here. I'm just chowing on food, and Gabby's like staring her. Seems you cannot accept your sins. Huh? What? Like, wait, why is she like? Did you forget the brutal acts this country's people have committed? Every Eldian needs to carry the sin properly. That's how we can open the path to eternal atonement. Is this related to the loss of your parents? Or our parents? Of course. The sin doesn't let you run away and pretend to be a good human. Is that what you've been taught in Marley? Like, wait. Wait, then she knows? What are you saying while we owe her one? Like, don't you dare say that this is not the universal view of, of history. Again, you, you are like this. Did I say anything wrong? What did you just say? Like, I don't know why you came here. But you're from Marley, right? Uh, yeah, like, shocked. How, how did you, how did I know? It's not, li it's not like... We even have an idea of how, how to make it back to Marley because they were yelling. Can't be freaking because you were yelling. Like, huh? 
Uh, so you knew from the beginning? Oh, what? From the beginning? It's like, uh-oh. That's really embarrassing. It's like, turn her back. It's like, why didn't you say anything? Oh, she's picking out, Gabby's picking out a pitchfork. It's awful. <clears throat> it's awful of you. Hey, Gabby's like, gonna, oh shoot. What are you doing? It's like, struggling over. That devil exposed us. I thought it was weird. The island devils could not be so kind. She is deceiving us. Hey, are you stupid? Or you're so stupid. Don't cause a scene here. Like, hey, oh, why are you fighting? Like, the parents are watching. Or no, oh, the little adopted kids. Maya's jealous. Oh, she's yelling. Mia's jealous of me for getting too friendly with her brother. It's like, looks like Kaya made, uh, made some new friends. She seems happy. Seems so. Don't play, don't play with a tool. It's dangerous. Yes. Like, like, why? What do you mean? If I want to report you guys, I would have done so already. It was like, lead them away? Four years ago. In the village that I lived in. Oh, she's taken them there. When Titans appeared inside the walls four years ago, one of them came to this village. It was not very big, only three meters tall. However, the people of the village ran away after seeing that Titan. Leave my crippled mother. Yep, that's the one Sasha had saved. I, I didn't know what to do. I just sat there, not being able to run or hide. I was sitting here, <laughs> take them to her place, from over there. I could hear the sounds of my mother being eaten. It went on for a while. My mother was being eaten alive. After some time, I stopped hearing any sounds. I must have screamed until my ears gave way. Oh shoot. According to the information disclosed four years ago, there are people outside the walls and they call us devils, but I don't understand why they hate us so much. Maya, Ben, tell me, my mom, just what did she do? What did she, what did she do to deserve this hatred? Like, they're shocked? That's because for a thousand years, we have been slaughtering people all over the world. A thousand years? Like, to think you forgot all that. For a thousand years, Eldians used the power of the Titans to subjugate and exploit the world. So why aren't they subjugating now? Still in, still in other century, uh, still in other cultures, forcing people to give birth to children they don't want, killing an uncountable number of people. Even if you devils inside the walls turn a blind eye, the world will never forget uh, these sins. And that's why things turn out the way they are now. Stop pretending to be the victim. Like, she's like confused, but my mother was born and raised in this area. I don't, I don't think she's ever done any any of those terrible things. Well, it's like hundred years ago, uh, your ancestors committed an unforgivable sin. Hundred years ago, but what did we do? Wait, what did we in the present do wrong? Recently, you destroyed my town. My mom died four years ago. That's not her fault. Well, it's like she's getting all these excuses. Your ancestors are mass massacre people around the world. My mom didn't kill anyone. It's like just pulling her eyes out. Mia, answer me. Why did my mom die such a painful death? There must be some reason. It just doesn't make sense. Why was my mother eaten alive? It's like, huh? Why did she die? Huh? Why? Uh, it was a reconstant mission. Like, Falco's coming in. Like, giving the explanation. From what I know, when we invaded Paradise Island four years ago, one of the objectives was to survey the enemy's power. It was an experiment to gauge the enemy's power. You and your mother were caught up in it. Oh, Falco's not. Falco's generally sad. Your mother did nothing wrong. I'm sorry. She didn't deserve that. She goes over the door and like kneels down. Revealing military secrets is, uh, to an enemy nation. Then you apologize. <clears throat> okay. Thank you, Ben, for letting me know. But you don't need to apologize. Just because you were born Marley. Looks about Falco's looking like off. So how did you survive in that situation, Kaya? Someone saved me. A girl who was a bit older than I am now brought an axe from the yard and fought with the Titan. Huh? With an axe for chopping firewood? How reckless. Yeah. And the axe is still on the wall. She used herself as a shield and rescued me. Run along this road until you find someone who can help you. And they found, she found her father. Was what she told me. 
If she was alive, she would never abandon you guys who have nowhere to go, just as she didn't abandon me. The Bronze, fa the Bronze family w was invited to the restaurant where the Marlins work. Let me take you there to meet them. I don't know if there is a way back to Marley. Why would you do that? Like, I, I want to be like Sasha, who she killed. Wow. You mean so kind? Did, did she like suspect that the, those are Sasha's killers? Or, yeah, he is, but Falco. Hmm. It's great that we saw like some of Sasha, even though she's like, we see her back. This is like what her perspective was. She knew the whole time because they were yelling. Like if, if you're in enemy territory, why would you be yelling like, oh, we gotta get back to Molly. We gotta get back to Molly. Like dummies. Like shut up. Freaking Gabby, like smack away mom's hand. Like, oh, you guys are devils. You guys did this, this, or something that we, that we think, that we think you did a thousand years ago. A hundred years ago, your, your ancestors committed an unforgivable sin. What was that, what was that sin a hundred years ago? They left? They saved all of humanity? Stopped everything? Went to, went to their own space? They were only telling that to get like their um their ice stones. All right. Uh, well, um, yeah. What are thoughts about this chapter? If you made it this far, um, yeah. If uh, you're new, subscribe, like, comment. Thank you for watching, and have a good rest of the day. Bye.